If you wanna become successful in music, this is gonna be your blueprint. So I started out struggling with music for 13 years. And I know what you're feeling like. Every single year you think, this is gonna be the year I do it. This is gonna be the year. This is gonna be my year, right? And you continue to write, you continue to record, maybe even continue to put out songs, but it's just not clicking. Maybe you're even at the point where you're not even releasing songs anymore and you're getting to the point where you're ready to give up. So that's where I was for just about 13 years until last year where I was able to scale my music business up to six figures. So I wanna share a little bit of my experience with you to try to shed some light and help you dig out of this hole that you're in. So let's get into it. So the first thing that you need to know is that you have to be able to put out a high quantity of high quality songs. If you're not able to do that, there's really no way, shape or form that you're gonna be able to build any kind of career out of music. Um, I know for me, that resulted in me wanting to learn how to produce my own songs because I wasn't able to rely on other people. You know, timelines get mixed up, you get pushed back, you get, you you know, you butt heads creatively and what have you, and and, and it ends up being just, just a mess. And that, that's what happened to me. And so I decided to take it upon myself to learn how to produce my own songs. And that's when things really started to change for me because I'm able to put out so much music and put out so much video content and afford to be able to run ads that I was able to easily grow my brand and put myself out there more. So the first thing you have to know is that you have to get control of the creative process. You have to know how to be able to create high quality songs, kind of like my client, Devin, my client, Devin Christodoulou. So he used to pay a thousand dollars per song to be able to put his music out and his music was high quality, but the problem was he was spending over a thousand dollars per song. So he wasn't able to consistently put out songs. He joined my rapid fire music Academy because he wanted to learn how to produce his own music. And in the first 90 days, which is how long the program is, he actually did three songs. So that means he produced, wrote, recorded, mixed, mastered three tracks. And I think he's at this point, he's put two of them out. He's got the third one on the way. So he is putting himself on a trajectory to be able to have a much more fruitful music career because he does that. Now, if you think that it's going to be too hard and it's going to take you too long to learn music production, let me change your mind about that. So I have a client named Jaden. And when he, before he started working with me, what he was doing was he was, you know, he had a friend who was a producer. Okay. He had a friend who was a producer and he was trying to get his first songs done. He had written some songs, but he was meeting up with his friend and they were trying to, you know, record and his friend would make the beats and do the mixing mastering. But what ended up happening was his friend couldn't meet up with him that much anymore. So he wasn't able to meet up with his friend and he wasn't able to get his songs done. And he was like, dude, what I'm going to do instead is I guess I'll try to learn how to produce my own music. But he was also afraid. Like Jaden was like, this is going to take me way too long to learn it on my own. So what, what ended up happening was he also joined my rapid fire music Academy and he got his first song completely finished in, I believe it was the first 60 days. So he wrote, so he learned music production. He produced, wrote, recorded, mixed, mastered, and released his first song in the first 60 days. This was in December. We're in June now. And he's been able to do one song per month. So he's just starting his career. He's only got six songs out total, but he's putting out a new song per month. And with every single song, he's putting out content, he's making videos. And because he doesn't have to spend money, you know, on beats or mixing mastering, when he's putting out his videos, he can run ads, he can do a lot of those types of things. So, you know, he it only took him like 60 days to get this stuff figured out. The thing was though, he didn't go and rely on YouTube videos to learn music production. He actually joined an academy like mine and got it all figured out. And the thing is, you might think to yourself, well, I might not be as good at producing as like a seasoned veteran. Here's the thing. I thought the same thing. When I first started to learn how to produce music, I was like, I'm not going to be as good as somebody who's been doing this for a while. That's true. But that doesn't mean that you're not going to make music that's good enough and still great to be able to get results. Like my song, Watch Me, I have gotten over 200,000 views on YouTube from that song. And I fully produced, wrote, recorded, mixed, and mastered it. My song, Necesito Que Regreses, has over 24,000 streams on Spotify. And I've even sold CDs and albums of songs that I fully produced. And I have another one on the way. It's going to be called Sunset Demos of 10 songs that I've fully produced and I'm going to put it out on even, even.biz and it's going to be a pay what you want thing. But what's super dope about this is like, as I'm kind of gearing up to get my new album out there, what I've got is 10 songs that I fully produced, wrote, recorded, mixed and mastered. I don't have any features on there and I don't have to pay anybody out. I don't have to split royalties. 
nothing. Like the actual ownership of the music is so simple and easy. And I have money to run ads because I didn't go spend it on the production side. So even if you think like you can't do it, you actually can. Now you've probably been writing and recording songs for a really long time. You probably even have a recording set up at your house, but you're paying out a lot of money for producers and you have to wait weeks and weeks for your songs to get back and you have to butt heads creatively and your songs don't even come out the way you want. This sucks. Music is the thing you love doing most in your life. Yes, you probably have a job and yes, you probably have a family, maybe you even have kids. But at the end of the day, the thing that you do that is you is music and you don't even love doing it because of all the complications that go along with it. Let's face it, that's not what we should be doing and that's not how you should be living your life. At the end of the day, if you could fully produce your own songs, produce instrumentals, record vocals, mix and master, and get it all done in just 90 days, how much would that actually change your life? And also, why would you wanna wait on that? If you could get that done and get that started, think about from right now, from the day and the moment you're watching this video, if 90 days from right now, you could fully produce, record, mix and master your own songs and they sounded great and you were excited to release them, how much would that change your life? If that sounds interesting to you, then just click below. I have a free training that literally shows you how you can do just that. It even comes with the exact blueprint and the client results. So at the beginning of this video, I told you this was a success blueprint to learn how to really grow a successful music career. And there's one thing that you need bar none to be able to create a successful music career. And that is to control the creative process and to put out a high quantity of high quality songs. And if you're not producing your own songs, I'm sorry, but it's just so difficult to do that. So to do it, all you need to do is click below and go watch the free training. Okay. This is going to be the thing that's going to set you up for success to own the creation process, to be able to put out songs as much as you want. All right. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you got lots of value and I'll talk to you on the next one.